That way it doesn't absorb all the way into the middle and that you get the most out of your foundation. So after you have put it in the water, go ahead and wring it out. You don't want it to be soaking wet, just a little bit damp. And now it's ready to be used. So take your favorite foundation, put it on your hand or on a nice clean plate, and then get going. All you have to do is just dip it right in, and then apply. This is better than a brush because sometimes when you're putting on foundation, a brush can leave strokes and it kind of looks like you just painted your face and it's not really appealing. This just makes it look airbrushed, it makes you look dewy, makes it look like it's your natural skin just a little bit better. You want to clean this every day after you use it because this is a reusable sponge, so here's how. Take your blender cleanser and put two drops of it on top of your blender. Then slowly start to massage it with your fingers. Then, place it under warm water and continue to massage it until all of the makeup has been removed. And that is how to use a beauty blender and how to clean it too. I'm Kirby and we'll see you next time on Monday.